believe where I'm coming from. I'm coming from outside. Where where else would I be coming from? <laughs> I'm coming from um, the shop, so I need to buy. I need to buy what is it called? Um, Chinese takeout. Like, do you know that feeling when you're craving something and you just cannot function if you don't do it? Not only you can't function, like you just want it. Like you just really want to eat that that thing. That's the kind of appetite that I have had for Chinese food. Chinese fried noodles specifically. Um, so there's a spot that my husband let me take you guys. So, anyways, you guys, I've been craving like the most delicious crispy noodles that my husband, um, my husband's colleague put him on and he puts me on. <laughs> it's so delicious, not just so crispy with duck and beef and um egg and you know it's so so nice anyway so uh, it's been a while that we had it so i wanted to really have it today uh my husband directed me to the place where they usually get it because it's hot it's out with the kids so i went there the they said the chef traveled he's on holiday blah 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 ah, i said i must eat this <laughs> noodles that i'm craving whether it's from him or from someone else Sha must eat it um so there's a um there's a chinese pot there's a, a restaurant i used to see along the road a takeout restaurant i used to see along the road um not far from where i stayed so i said ah me i'm going to i'm going to look for it i've not tasted theirs their food before i've not tasted their food before or anything like that but i said i must eat this chinese takeout that has been hungering me if i should say the word hungering me as soon as i went to go and buy um, so let's check it out. I hope it's delicious. I hope it's tasty um, Even if not, you know up to the power of the one that I want, but I just hope that it's good So let's let's try. Let's have a try. <laughs> Let me put this back here first back to my My food. Let me wash my hand because I have such raw poultry Anytime you order from Chinese um, whatever take out or They always give you this um, is it crackers they call it Chinese crackers. I really don't like it. I'm not a fan of it. Even with the other um, takeout restaurant, they always give this. That's it. There. That's it. I'm sure you know Chinese crackers. Mm. This one doesn't feel bad actually. So I like to. Oopsie. It's pouring. Oh, it's pouring. We never reach out. So we never eat time. It's pouring already. Oh my god. It's so hot. So I don't know why this is pouring over there it is so I said creepsy noodles I don't know why these people brought I can see it watery this is not what I want to this is the thing yeah this is the thing I said creepsy noodles oh my gosh when I tell you I am so disappointed I'm not even joking I said creepsy noodles, fried creepsy noodles. These guys gave me what is this? I mean the let me even have a taste of the chicken. Mm -mm 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 -mm. This is oh my god. Oh my god. This is not what I was expecting when I ordered fried creepsy chicken. Jesus Christ. So because money cannot go to waste, I had to look for a means to make it more eatable, if I should say. Anyway, so I had to fry it um like a stir fry. I fried the um noodles first, then I fried the meat, um, added um suya spices. As you can see, I was also also adding suya spices to the meat here. So that's how I was able to eat it. Oh good. Let me drink my beer first. See, this is a gentle reminder to you to always know what you order when you go and buy food. Especially if you're ordering something that is not within your culture. One, and ordering something at a restaurant that you're new to, that you've not gone before for the first time you're ordering something. Be mindful because that creepsy noodles that you think is creepsy noodles in terms of fried noodles is not actually fried noodles it's creepsy noodles creepsy emphasis of creepsy not fried 
What an utter embarrassment. What an utter failure of what I ordered. This is a clear case of what I ordered versus what I got. Reality versus expectation of the expectation versus reality. I got an absolute opposite of what I thought I was going to get. On the menu, they said Cripsy noodles. And I thought it was fried noodles, like fried Cripsy. Do you get? It was absolutely not fried noodles. And it was my fault. Do you know, at a point when I opened it, I was so disgusted by the noodles that I put all the things I ordered, except the chicken wings, which was mm, chef's case, it was really nice. Aside the chicken, um, the chicken wings, I put the other things I ordered into the bag and I wanted to return it. And I stopped and I said, let me even research what I ordered, like Cripsy noodles. Is there something like Cripsy noodles and not actually fried noodles? Fried noodles. And then I realized that there's something like Cripsy noodles. And it is not what I was expecting to order. I was the one that was wrong. Anyways, let me not give a long story about that situation let me drink my beer <laughs> yes let me drink my beer i actually like this beer it's called desperado anyways the reason why i'm here is not just to tell you the utter failure of ordering food is to show you um, a few things i got at zara i'm just looking like plain i feel like i should wear earrings that's the zara box um i've opened it as you can tell because i was impatient to excite to see what i got so i've opened it but i just want to show you guys what is inside so the first item i want to show you guys is this jacket so the cropped um, jacket when i was going on the website to um, shop for whatever on my mind i actually wanted a cropped jacket and that is what i got let me put on the um my light i'm coming so this is the first cropped jacket i got um this is really expensive for me Expen expensive is relative so for me this is quite expensive um but yes yeah, so this is um 79 pound but i think i got it for 59.99 which is about 60 pound so this is how this one looks right um i'm not really sure about the jackets to be honest i'm not not so sure about the jackets i just feel like they're not giving me I just feel like they're not giving me that wow i love it wow what a jacket like the rest of the zara jackets that i've got has, has given to me it's just there it's just there do you get and it's quite expensive so i'm thinking should i return it or you know maybe it's my hair at the moment that's not giving me the vibe um maybe i'm not you know fitting it well at the moment I'm, I'm not wearing it i'm not pairing it well but anyway it's not giving me that wow at all this is the hands of it so that's the hands of it that's how it is there's no button it's just like a slit on the hand um and that's it basically that's the back the second one all right this is the second one and um, this is a blue one um hopefully you've seen the color well but yeah so that's the blue one the blue one has um buttons let me just try it on so you see so this is the blue one um you can see it has good buttons um on the side on the hands also it has good buttons the guys on the side on the front <laughs> um it has good buttons also on the hands that's the other cropped one when i wore it the first time i wasn't feeling it but let me look in the mirror today <laughs> hmm. it seems like today today i actually seem to be i seem to be liking it today but the first time i wore them i wasn't so sure um i think i'm also liking this one today tell me what you think i feel like i'm going to possibly return this one i'm going to try it again tomorrow in daylight in broad daylight and see how i feel about it but i still don't i, I still i'm not sure about this one to be honest that one i think i'm going to keep but this one is not um it's not convincing me you get but yeah so that's that one anyways that's a cropped one next one 
And I just want to show you guys, it's this really fun, <laughs> fun shirt that I got. Um, I, there, were, there was another shirt that I wanted to get from Zara, but it was sold that before I could, you know, check out. So uh, I guess somebody else was faster than me. Anyways, that's the result. Let me try this one so you see how this one is. Yeah, so that's a bliss shirt. Um, I mean, the front is just, is cropped again <laughs> that's the vibe this summer cropped tops cropped jacket um you know so it just look smart kind of anyways so the front as you can see is um normal you know no big deal no mass shirt no mass stripey blue shirt and then boom that's really our old conventional parents or aunties i'm not saying you're a very very bad girl you're a bad girl mm -mm -mm. you're not decent you will not marry my brother you're a bad girl <laughs> i need to wear something else first so um i'm actually wearing um an inner and i'm wearing a different trouser as you can see but yeah i'm wearing this um vest um this what's it called body vest um it's not actually body vest what's it called that goes round oh what do they call them i bought two i bought two actually of that um i don't know what they call them again i've forgotten what they call them but anyway body suit yeah body suit body suit yeah so um i bought um two body suits i bought the white and the black i just wore the white on top because indecency at the back <laughs> anyways i wrote them to a black and a um and a white um bodysuit so i think the bodysuit is actually very good i like the bodysuit because it doesn't you know come up and all that and i bought them in size large zara size is large when i'm having medium or small on other side on other brands zara size is actually large but anyways yeah, so I think it's usually fifteen pound, but um, I got it for ten pound nine ninety nine, I think. So, I think they're good um to layer up on clothes and um other stuff. Basically, the last thing I want to show you guys that I ordered is this beautiful jacket. It's not a jacket; it's a shirt, actually. Let me not say it's a jacket. Let's see the there it's not a jacket but it looks like a bomber jacket but it's actually a black shirt which i love oh, i love this one this is the only one okay this one and the blue one are the ones that gave me that <sighs> i'm in love yeah actually this one this is the best one on this um shopping that i did let me know what your best one is this is my best i love it um, i feel like i should have gone a bit um smaller but i also also love this large oversized vibe going on you know so i feel like i can just um tie it up you know i think i can just tie it up i don't know if you can see it well but it has um this yeah you can see it now it has this um zip which makes it um it gives you the feel of like a bumper jacket let's see yeah so there you go so it has a pocket here and um the cuff is like banded it has banded cuff i hope that's what you call it uh, but yeah, I started tying it, which I think I'll do. Um, you can also leave it like that. It's like a paper bag um, material, you know, it's very lightweight. What's up? Anyway, so those are the things that I got from Sarah. I hope you enjoy watching this part of the video. I'm now going to either do a reel or go to bed. So, I'll see you guys next time. A big reason to be happy. Oh gosh, I'm so, so excited.